your first warning weather with meteorologist Darren Stack. Plenty of sunshine in store for your Friday, but it will remain unseasonably cool. All thanks to a cold front that moved through here late last night. Didn't really bring anything in the way of cloud cover or, or rain, but it's lingering off to the east in the cold air and dry airs filtering in behind it. Now with that front still close to the area, and we do see a disturbance coming up the east coast during your Saturday morning. There's a chance for just a few spot showers. You can see our high res future cast really isn't picking up much in the way of rain. But notice up along the border belt, there's even a little bit of a mix out there possible or even a brief flurry or two. Accumulation is not expected from this. The rain chances are few and far between and the chance for anything other than that frozen few and far between as well, but most locations are staying fairly dry as we go through your Saturday morning and into the afternoon. Can't rule out a stray shower or two with a lot of excess cloud cover. We're holding on to some of those clouds overnight and in through Sunday morning. Sunday afternoon, we'll see a little more sunshine and that's when the warmth really starts to return and we hold on to that warmth even into the very beginning of next week. Today and tomorrow, though, remaining unseasonably cool and a little bit breezy for today. High temperatures generally in the low 50s, even the border belt area staying in the upper 40s to around 50 degrees, despite a good deal of sunshine. Overnight, those clouds thicken up and it will be cold, especially away from the coastline where we do see the temperatures down into the 30s and around the freezing mark along the border belt. That's the reason why we could see the possibility of that isolated shower being a brief bit of a sleep shower or even a flurry mixed in there as well. That won't be the case area wide though. As we go to your Saturday afternoon, low to mid 50s for your highs. Sunday and Monday, we're in the 70s, but look at this. A cold front coming through here Sunday night and Monday night, I should say, into early Tuesday morning. Uh, that will bring in a blast of cold air, unseasonably cold conditions. Those advertised around 63. The rain chances are relatively slim with this frontal passage. Monday looks like it's going to be mainly a dry day, but mostly cloudy. There's the front off to our west on high res futurecast at this point. Now, this could change between a Monday late evening into early Tuesday morning, a little later into Tuesday morning and into the midday. We'll keep an eye on the timing of the frontal passage and the amount of rain still at this point looks like it's going to be relatively slim. So we're going to hold a 30% chance of some showers for your Monday evening in through early Tuesday morning with still some excess cloud cover and colder air coming in as we head into the middle of next week. All in all, not a bad looking weekend forecast. Just be prepared for the much cooler and cloudier day on Saturday with a slim chance of a few rain showers with more sunshine and warmth for your Sunday. Have yourself a great Friday and a wonderful weekend. As always, you can get your latest news and weather updates on your website, carolinalive.com.